People who call Myrtle Grove Trailer Park home are packing up and moving out. Flint Township officials told them their park was to be demolished starting today. But we went by today and found no signs of demolition. People there tell us they're scrambling to figure out what's next. Tonight, Catholic Charities tells me that they are helping out with housing for those residents who were told they needed to get out because the trailer park is unlivable. It's a very unfortunate situation what the residents of Merle Grove are going through. So Catholic Charities wants to do all that we can to assist. CEO Katie Baxter and housing supervisor Glenn Griffin tell me they are connecting people in Myrtle Grove Trailer Park with help. Griffin says he walked the whole park last week talking to people. We checked on their condition to see did they have any place set up um, past Myrtle Grove. It was some, a, a good portion of them had uh, future places to go. But those that didn't, we just uh, offer resources for them to talk to the navigator. Housing navigators at Catholic Charities help get people into rentals. To see if we can assist them and uh, try to get them with a, at least a smart rent and deposit situation. According to Flint Township, there are 38 homes in Myrtle Grove. Some have squatters inside. Others are people who've paid for their trailer, like Reggie Kondraki. Quite a few people are trying to find places as fast as possible. They're panicking. Reggie says he paid $800 for his trailer. Now the whole place is being torn down because, as Township Supervisor Karen Miller puts it, the place is not suitable for anyone. Mark Mitchell is also trying to find somewhere to go. Just trying to get into another place. Both Reggie and Mark tell us Catholic Charities did talk to them. For anyone who needs assistance for housing, Catholic Charities of Shiawassee and Genesee counties are reminding people to call 810-600-4525. There's two extensions, 501 or 502, and you'll be able to speak with someone.